what's up world it's your man slim jim longfoot aka the goat king of america welcome to day 629 of diabetes and not the daily vlog series they gotta do to combat this type 2 diabetes with the one two you feel me yo it ain't you know yo it ain't it ain't even a question you know what i'm saying we beating the crap out of it you feel me because i ain't you know what i'm saying it's it's I, I I don't claim it. You feel me? I don't claim it at all. You know what I'm saying? You know when they say you got diabetes, well, you know, you know, hey, diabetes ain't got me. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't even gonna say I got it. I, I rebuke it. I rebuke it. You feel me? That's what I do. I rebuke it. You know what I'm saying? That's why I spend each and every one of these days making it do what it do, get better on every level. You feel me? Anyway. For those that are new here, you know what I'm saying, um, you know, hit that subscribe button, you know what I'm saying, if you want to keep up on all things Slim Jim Longfoot, such as my product reviews, my how-to videos uh, for YouTubers, my TV and movie reviews, my um, reactions, my live streams, my video clips, my daily vlogs that you're watching right now, and last but not least, my art video series, GOAT 1408 TV. Uh, shout out to the members of the live chat crew, which consists of Evie Cavallo, the Greek Goddess, Lady Capricorn, Terra, Sexy Trees, Queen Candace, uh, Kiana Vision, Diamond TV, Michelle, Michael Marshall, Life's Magical Journey, and last but not least, my sis, the big sis of YouTube, with Tanya Porter. Special consideration to my um, bro, Johnny Quest Gaming, who co-hosts the Nerd Strip Club with me. And shout outs to the members of the 1408, which includes Kid Wonders, Life of Wonder, Gaming Mode, Advice with Mail, and last but not least, Parents Junk Closet. If you yourself would like to be a member of the 1408, all you got to do is hit that join button below, you know what I'm saying, see which tier works for you, and make it do what it do, you feel me? So that's what I want you to do. That's what I want you to do. That's what I want you to do. What's going on, people? So, um, anyway, going to make this thing do what it do. Um, shout out to my pop. He's playing the Christmas music early this uh, morning. You know what I'm saying? Always a great time to be in the Christmas spirit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, rest in peace uh, to his cousin, Lucille. They found her, and you know, um, on the other side of this plane of existence last night. You know what I'm saying? Uh, condolences uh, to... Uh, that side of the family right there, you know what I'm saying, uh, that part, you know, uh, today in history, uh, today is the 22nd of November 2021, um, on this date in history, um, the 36, um, the 36th president of the United States of America was assassinated, uh, John Fitzgerald Kennedy, uh, in Dallas, Texas, on this date back in 1963. Uh, yeah, he was uh, the at the time the, one of the youngest elected presidents um, in you know U.S. history. Um, he was the first president um, elected that was born in the 20th century in the 1900s. And uh, yeah, so uh that part you feel me uh let me let me make sure if i remember correctly because i said i did say what uh, excuse me i'm sorry not 36 35th president I, I i knew i knew i could have been right in my head that's why i wanted to look it up then because yeah lyndon johnson is the 36th president uh jfk was the 35th excuse me the 35th president of uh, the united states of america um he was killed on this date uh 50 58 years ago now 58 years ago now that is you know that is a whole trip oh and i'm in my new booklet now i told y'all that yesterday was uh the last day of my old booklet here we are in my new booklet you know i mean of course it looks the same obviously but it's fresh brand new ain't been wrote in except for you know the first seven days of the week you see i got it you know got the dates uh for monday through sunday you know what i'm saying and you see it says uh up there at the top starts at day 620 starts on day 629 on the week of november 22nd 2021 and uh now i'm about to write uh my first entry into the book as far as my number go you know what i'm saying and we been making it do what it do from there you know what i'm saying to improve on our numbers because numbers don't lie baby numbers don't lie and you know what I'm saying and i think i have done a great job 
from the beginning of this book to uh, from the beginning of the last book to where I am now, you know what I'm saying, in terms of health, in terms of weight. Um, like I say, I don't weigh myself, but I know I weigh less than I did when I started the last book. That's for sure, because, I mean, you know, all you got to do is, you know, check your pants sizes. And, you know, I've been decreasing in pants size for the past, um, consistently for the past uh, few months. Um, I know at the beginning of this year, I think I was probably like at uh, 38 or 36 um, now I'm like close to early 36, like can tinker on 34s or whatnot, you know, whatever, whatever is like that. Anywho, um, today is 11, it's 11.04 right now, it's 11.04 in the morning, so I'm not going to hold y'all too long on this. For this uh, breakfast this morning, I have my shells with white cheddar cheese um, from what I had last night. I got some bacon bits sprinkled in it, you know what I'm saying, that is my meal for the day. You know, got to stock up on some other stuff. Mm -hmm. When it's tight like that booty, you know what I'm saying, you got to make it do what it do. So, mm. That's good too. I'm going to gorge even harder after this is done. So. Like I said, y'all, like I say a lot of times on the daily vlogs, you got to live each and every day. Not necessarily like it's your last, but you got to live each and every day to the fullest. And don't go with the mindset thinking, oh, this is going to be my last day. Go with the mindset of this is going to be my best day. It's a big difference between thinking, oh, this is going to be my last day. No, think of it as your best day. You want each and every day to be your best day. Because one of these days will be your last day. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Like I said, there are people who, you know what I'm saying, was here yesterday, not here today. You know what I'm saying? And there, guess what? There are people who are here today that wasn't here yesterday. I know y'all like, wait, what? Don't forget, people are born too. So, you know, someone who wasn't here yesterday is here today. So, you got to look at a, a positive thought, a positive side to things. The fact that someone's last day was yesterday, yes, but someone's first day is today. You feel me? And you think about the fact that somebody who is being born today will probably be alive 100 years from now in the year 2121. Someone born today on November the 22nd, 2021 will still be here a hundred years from now celebrating their 100th birthday November 22nd 2121 2121 you feel me you think about that of course they'll be good and old then and won't know nothing about the world before they were born but you know it's you know it's like yeah what is this like Rodney Dangerfield, a um, legendary comedian. He was born in 1921. And just the other day, um, his birthday had just passed, so he would have been 100 years old now. You know, think about the fact he was born in 1921, and here it is, it's 2021. Of course, he didn't make it to 2021. He died back in 2004. But still, you think about the fact that, like, wow, you know. Like people that were born in 1921, people who were born in the beginning of the 1920s, you know, they are now approaching 100 years old. You know, notable figures such as uh, Betty White, who birthday is in January, she'll be 100 years old, January 17th, um, 2022. She was born in 1922. Also born the same year as her. He's gone now, but the late great Stan Lee. It's funny because he was born at the end of that year. She was born at the beginning of 1922. He was born at the end. You know, they're both for the same sign, which is my sign, the Capricorn. She was born in January. He was born in December. So that's our trip. As a matter of fact, uh, this month marks uh, the month that uh, Stan Lee died. He died in November of 2018, if I recall correctly. Yeah, he died in November of 2018, um, which is, you know, 
the whole trip, you know. So, uh, you know, life, man, life. That's 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 what we all share in common. That's what we all have in common. Life, along with death, because you know, it, it comes to us all the same way we were all born. We all gonna leave here as well. Trust me, I hate it. I do. But then again, you know, there are days where I'm like, okay, what's what's the other side gonna be like? You know, are we going to actually go to our destination places, heaven and hell, and await the final battle? Are we, excuse me, are we gonna be reincarnated into another form here on this plane of existence? Or another plane of existence? You know what I'm saying? Like, if I die, when I, when I die, will I be reborn like 50 years later, a generation later? It'll be the year 2480. I'll be born like 500 years after my previous self. I don't know. But just in case I am, hey, future me that's living in I guess what would be the year 2521 when my future self is the same age that I am now you know my future self 500 years after I was born is the same age I am now in the year 2521 so 500 years from now <laughs> which would be a thousand years after the renaissance period like just think the renaissance period happened over 500 years ago what's going on 500 years ago you think about the fact that there are people from 500 years ago whose names are still known now leonardo da vinci Raphael, michelangelo donatello of course those four guys in particular they're now known as ninja turtles <laughs> you know but um but yeah life is a whole trip but anyways on to the next part of this whole situation it is time for the It's time for the shout outs, baby. It's 11 11 right now. 11 11 a.m. Angel numbers, baby. Angel numbers. You know what I'm saying? Shout outs uh, to my folk life. She had an awesome uh, live last night. Shout outs to Vern's Junk Closet. She had an awesome live earlier yesterday. Uh, shout outs to um, other people who I have come across, you know, who had uh, lives throughout um, yesterday. Um, last night. I dropped a video how to draw a stick figure and this morning I dropped a little video clip of uh, the incident between LeBron and as I said some guy from the Pistons because I don't know the dude um, whatever whatever like that and so also uh, yesterday is day of vlog day 628 so we're gonna start off with LeBron versus some guy from the Pistons see if anybody coming in on that let's see um, wellness with frugal mama said, Oh, we heard about that. And Buzz will say, I know who it is, yo. His name is Isaiah Stewart. That is uh, the young man's name who was charging in the video. Isaiah Stewart, I won't remember it tomorrow. Well, I remember it since Buzz will put it up here. I'm not erasing Buzz Wolf's comment since he posted it up, but you know, I mean, you gotta, you gotta get some years on your belt before I remember you. You know, because I don't even watch basketball like that no more. So, you know, I know LeBron because, I mean, obviously LeBron's been around for almost 20 years now. So, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I remember LeBron, you know, back during the days when I was watching basketball. But, yeah, that fool just cemented his highlight career, if you want to call that a highlight or would that be a low light? I don't know. But I mean, that's that's what he'll be remembered for is in the, for all the time. Hey, 
You remember the guy with the bloody face that was running at LeBron? That, that's who you are now. You're the bloody dude. <laughs> You're going to have to win like about as many championships as Jordan to be known as anything else other than the bloody dude that was uh, running at LeBron. And that's, that's, that's who you are now. <laughs> like, for real. Also, we got how to draw a stick figure, y'all. And man, it's 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 trying to take off, y'all. It's trying to take off. I thought it was something pretty cool. So here we go. We got in the regular comment sections for that. Nobody was for the was there for the live chat for it. I know that already off the bat. Um, in the uh, regular comment section, we got Soul Star sketching said, "Finally, the guy everyone needs." You probably have a good clue how many times I've heard the phrase, I can't even draw a stick figure. That part. You know, so for those that say they can't draw a stick figure, I broke it down for you, baby. I broke it down for you. So you can no longer say that you can't draw a stick figure because I got a whole video telling you, showing you how to draw a stick figure. And it's called How to Draw a Stick Figure. <laughs> Muscular Axe, uh, new to the channel, he said, I really sat here for three minutes and watched bro draw a stick figure. L M A O. Good ish, man. Sub. Hey, appreciate you, Muscular Axe. Muscular Axe, uh, he has a channel as well where he combines gaming and fitness. So definitely be on the lookout for that. You know, check out his channel. Um, let's see. Um, I'm about to let him know that as well. I do shout outs. I do shout outs on my channel and mentioned your comment be be on lookout for daily vlog six twenty nine Today, so once again, shout out to Muscular Axe who has a channel um, that is uh, focused on gaming, uh, reactions, and exercise. So, you know, definitely check out the young man straight up. Uh, let's see. Uh, one deliterate said drawing 101. That part, you feel me. Devon Rose said, this take me back in the ninth grade. All right, good times. A hey. Life's Magical Journey said, on point. And I say on to her. And you know this. And you know this. Let's see. Uh... Wellness with Frugal Mama said, coming through with the thumbs up. Appreciate you, Frugal Mama, straight up. Latanya Porter said, thank you, bro, bro. Good job. Ever needs a refresh. You feel me? Or maybe she meant to say everyone needs a refresh. That part. Johanna Hart said, nice one, dear. Hey, appreciate it. Visionary Queen said, LMFAO. Wait, with the laughing emojis. Hey, you feel me? Uh, Fable Lily, Fable Lily, Slim Jim Longfoot. For, for those that don't know, she said, LOL, Slim, what are you doing, LOL? Hey, I'm, I'm trying to teach the people, trying to teach the people some things. And Tristan Bell said, hello. What's up, Tristan? That part. So shout outs to everybody thus far who coming in on that video and looking forward to more comments as people, of course, you know, Find the wisdom, find the tutelage to how to draw a stick figure. Now for day 628. Day 628, those that was in the regular comment section, laid back, way back in the playback, Maybach. Nikki said, lovely premiere. Keep doing these videos, Slim. Hey, appreciate it, Nikki, and I will be, you feel me? Um, Charlene Hill, the healing Charlene Hill said, saying it again, divine healing, my brother, may these titles turn into how I healed and no longer have the or something to that effect. That part, you feel me? That part, that part. I receive that and manifest what you said, my sister, and go make it do what it do. We healing each and every day. We ain't breaking down. We healing, baby. 
we healing we getting better each and every day until it's the last day you feel me change your mindset change your thinking change your life life's magical journey also said loving that synchron um um synchron synchronicity you know i gotta get the word right synchronicity loving that synchronicity hashtag 271 i am going live later on just about to schedule it now have a great day goats hey that part like i said she went live yesterday uh, she did an uh, awesome audio yesterday life in audio form outside of her body giving us her vocals her audio as we received that was awesome you know what i'm saying nothing like great conversation natural laricia said thanks for sharing as always some a appreciated nap and speaking of nap i of course have in my head and in my beard her scalp and hair oil uh, from nl organics uh, today is day 13 out of the two weeks that i said that i was going to just use it and only it in my hair and my beard tomorrow is the last uh day that i will be using it um in my hair and my um beard you know for um the foreseeable time as far as that go as far as you know just by itself um i'll you know talk about it i will be talking about it tomorrow you know what i'm saying doing tomorrow's daily vlog since tomorrow will be the last day so be on the lookout for that y'all for me to you know speak on it um after you know two weeks i mean you know like i said i'm gonna talk about it tomorrow you know what i'm saying I'm, uh reline i'm gonna you know freshen up my hairline and all that stuff you know mm. Mm. also another reason i'm having myself refreshing by tomorrow because at 1 p.m tomorrow i'll be doing i'll be going live for part two of the convo with angel pool 215 channel so y'all be on the lookout for that eat to live strong my folk eat to live strong georgia peach herself she said hey fam what up eat to live strong life's magical journey said hey slim what's up lifey latonia porter said replay gang hey bro bro what it do though and pretoria afro said hello there what's up pretoria how you doing now for those that was in the live chat for yesterday's daily vlog in the live chat we got oh yeah yeah we we was flooded yesterday and which was a beautiful thing we were straight flooded with the booski compound the uh, Vern's junk closet ray after Vern's um channel agenda uh ended yesterday because uh i recorded this before um the channel agenda ended i recorded it when it was actually going on and i had um uploaded it and i had my my um sound was off because uh the music was too out so i had to re-upload it with uh my music editing of course and uh boom 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 make it do what it do so um the booski raid um eat to live strong was in the building in the live chat nikki was in the live chat wellness when frugal mama was in the live chat Vern's junk closet was in the live chat naptural lavricia was in the live chat um who else was in the live chat uh community advocate network who uh, of course um interviewed Vern this uh past sunday for national adoption day to help Vern um find the uh her relatives who are related to her through her mother um, her uh, birth mother, uh, Pauline Brooks Gibson. Um, shout out to Community Advocate um, Network for coming through. Uh, who else came through? Uh, let's see. Uh, Charlene Hill came through. Let's see. Who else came through? uh let's see uh visionary queen came through shout out to visionary queen coming through um sharon garing came through shout out to sharon garing for coming through 
and that was it that was everybody who came through yesterday i appreciate each and every last one of y'all for coming through yesterday on the daily vlog and you know who you is you in here today i appreciate you for coming up in here for the live chat today and if you didn't come up in here for the live chat if you watching this via replay laid back way back in the playback maybach i appreciate you as well so with that being said i'm about to go ahead and get up out of here y'all enjoy the rest of my day and i want y'all to do the same thing as well because hey you know what i'm saying don't take no days for granted don't take no days for granted. The days of taking days for granted is over. You know what I'm saying? Live life till you die. Make it do what it do. Every day, all day. Give thanks not just on Thursday. Give thanks right now. Give thanks for yesterday. Give thanks for today. And keep on doing just that. Not just on a day that them people tell you to. You feel me? That the, the people that run this country tell you to or whatever give thanks every day don't say oh well it's this time of the year i need to start giving thanks it's this time of the year i need to start showing love it's just the time of the year i need to uh you know help out my fellow man it's this time of the year i need to worry about breast cancer it's this time of the year i need to worry about this that and third you no know, you work and you you have this on your mind each and every day you know don't say oh well you know it's this month so i gotta do this this month mm -mm. we are already on the schedule of a, a cycle a, a horrid cycle of paying bills every month you know what i'm saying you know you gotta be on the cycle of loving every month you gotta be on the cycle of giving every month you gotta be on the cycle of receiving every month receive your blessings manifest it all because it's already here baby it's already here better know that rain it down baby rain it down video playlist watch them all right one love